Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Chara. Let's continue the React.js tutorial series. Now in this video tutorial, I will explain in React.js how to implement Bootstrap Date Picker. Now let's check the final output implementing Bootstrap Date Picker in React.js using class component. Now when I user click the date picker control, notice here I got a calendar here. Now I select any date, see here we got the date. 15. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. I'm using Visual Studio Code to create a React.js application. Just for the time saving, I have already created one application called chkml insert in this above folder let me expand my application the project notice in this project there is a source folder let me allow to expand the source folder all my js files which are the components whether it's a functional or class component i am creating in this source folder now for this example also i am creating a new class component in this source folder right click the source folder new file and the class file is, uh, and the class name is, um, the file name is, sorry, uh, bootstrap, bootstrap, date picker, dp.js. And here we got our JS file. In React.js, we can create two types of components. One is functional component and second one is a class component. But, when we want to create a component, first we need to import the React class from the React library. Let's add that one first. Import React from the React library. After that, I'm defining one simple class, and the class name is my file name, which is a bootstrap dp, and m extends react.component. And after that, at the bottom, of every class component we need to export default my class name which is a bootstrap dp now in every class component there are two important methods we must add one is a uh, render method and the second one is inside the render method there is a return method and this return method contains the HTML elements which displays the output on the browser. Now I am adding the root element which is a div element. Inside this div element I am adding one header tag h1 uh, implementing bootstrap date picker in reactions. Let's add the another heading react.js tutorials and after that I am adding one horizontal line now after the horizontal line I want to create one date picker bootstrap date picker so first we need to install the bootstrap to our project first let's save this file now to install the bootstrap to our project, go to view, in Visual Studio, go to view, terminal. And here we got our terminal. If you notice in the terminal, the path contains D column. This is a folder. The above folder, inside this folder, I have created my project. So let's add my project to this path, cd change directory, chk mark insert, enter. So after adding my project to this path, now I can able to install um, Bootstrap. Now here the command is npm install react-bootstrap, enter. And here the Bootstrap packages are installing into this folder which is into my application. And after I install the packages, here I got some warnings here. So here I got some npm audit fix. 
to erase this errors let's add that one also let me check add it add it fix enter okay now done everything is perfect now after installing the bootstrap now let's import dead picker from react iphone dead picker notice here the intelligence is showing the react packages react components now after that below the horizontal line in the return method i'm adding the date picker this is a reference date picker let's close the date picker and inside this date picker i want to display the date first let's check the output save all to run our application first in the index.js file we need to add our component in the render method as well as we need to import our component in the header section also now let's save all after saving the file now we'll run our application to check how it looks npm start and here we got the output at this moment we got the headings horizontal line and one date picker now when i click on the date picker notice here we are getting the date uh, calendar but it's not in the uh, proper calendar because we need to add the css tags for that uh, switch over to our component uh, in the index.js file we require uh, required between single calls we require the react date picker css styles react date picker forward slash this forward slash react date picker dot css uh, that's it let's add the semicolon save this file save all we'll check the new output again i'm reloading the browser now when i click the mouse in the date picker notice we got a calendar here now when i try to select any date it's not selecting the date to select the date let's create one state in our component in our class component now in the class i'm defining one constructor to create a state whenever we define a constructor the next step immediately we require the super meta so once we add the super meta we can able to create this dot state is equals to this dot state is equals to let's define date empty dates now here in the date picker selected proper time adding this dot state dot date this state value date here at this moment the date the selected date is empty and also I require the date format property is equals to it's not curly backwards we need to add between single quotes dd mm i'm adding triple m and yyy the format i have added and after that the selected date we require one event for that i'm adding um, select date select date select date is equals to i'm creating an event it's an arrow function in this arrow function i'm adding to change the state or to modify the state we need to add this dot set state method set state method is a hook inside this hook i'm adding date uh, date this date i'm changing date colon 
the target E. Now here on change method is equals to this dot our function name is a select date select date that's it now let's save this file save all oops here we got another fail to compile select date is not defined select date the event is defined here uh, I think something is missing here Let's add the colon here. I'm removing this thing here. Let's save this file. Save all. Oops. Now it's working perfectly. We forgot to close the constructor. Again, I'm saving the file. Now we'll check the output. I'm reloading the browser. Now let's check the final output. Implementing Bootstrap Date Picker in React Gas using class component. When I click the date picker control, notice I got the date picker calendar here. When I select the date, see here we got the date. Oops, month is not correct. Let's add the capital M. Now save this file. Sorry about that. M is capital M. Now we'll check the final output. Now let's check the final output implementing bootstrap date picker in React Gears using class component. Now when I user click the date picker control, notice here I've got a calendar here. Now I select any date, see here we got the date. 15. That's it in this video tutorial. I have explained how to implement the date picker, bootstrap date picker in React Gears component. Thanks for watching and please subscribe my channel. Catch you in my next video tutorial.